Luke Payne with us. He is the punter for the Lackawanna College Falcons. We're at our Carol Novell, the pizza capital of the world. Uh, Luke Payne, and he is a Lackawanna Falcon. Did you think that would kind of be the ring, or did you think you'd wind up somewhere else? How'd you wind uh, up as a, a Falcon? Uh, well, I, I was looking at other schools to play kicker, actually. I, I, I just I wanted to play kicker in high, uh, college. That's what, that's what I wanted to do, and Coach Bear uh, contacted me and said, that he thinks I could come here and play punter, so I told him, all right. Um, I, I heard about their punter last year, Brad. He went to uh, Penn State. I heard about success from other punters, uh, other kickers who went here, so he just gave me confidence. It, it showed me that if I go here and I work hard, I could do what I want to do in the long run. A couple guys I talked to from the Falcons, like, man, I never even saw the place. I just, I just they gave me a call, and I was like, yeah, I'm coming. I'm up for you. Did, did you get a little feel for the campus, a little feel for the coaches, some of the other players? What was your experience like to say, okay, this seals the deal, I'm going there? Yeah, I, I came down here with uh, my mom and my, my brother, and I, I really liked it down here. I, I, I saw, I talked to some of the players, heard their success stories, heard what, what hard work can do for you here, and heard about Coach Duda, heard about, talked to Coach Duda, had, had good conversations, and I knew that Lackawanna was going to be a place for me. Let's talk about the, how you got involved. How did you first start kicking, punting, a soccer player? Yeah, I'm a soccer player. I played all, all my life. I played high school soccer. Um, or I played soccer and then I played four years in high school. But I actually just started kicking my senior year. Uh, and I, I didn't start punting until like the last three games. So <laughs> I, 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 I didn't, I was, I was a kicker at heart really. And then I, I just, I started working on my craft. Uh, I really wanted to become a punter. I, that's what I wanted to do. So I got into it. it I enjoy it. Obviously that's why I'm here. So yeah. You're from Virginia, so to take us back to the hometown, the high school. What was it like growing up for you? I went to Liberty High School in Bealton, Virginia, a small town. Um, everybody loves the Friday night lights, though. Everybody comes out, shows support. Uh, loved go loved every Friday night with my teammates. It was fun. Uh, we always had a good time. We were a good team, uh, and they're doing well right now. They're 7-0. and So, yeah. So a lot of pride back in that yeah. community. How about your family? Talk, uh, talk to us about what role they play in it, and who are the key players for you that, that push those right buttons for you? My brother is definitely a big big uh, component in that. He, he always is pushing me to be a better player, always pushing me to be a better person, as well as my mother. She's always texting me. Um, my father does the same thing. Those three are like my, my rock. They keep me keep, keep me going every day. My motivation to keep going, even when time is tough. You got some tough dudes here at Lackawanna College, but at the same time, they're pretty embracing uh, to say, hey man, you're missing home or you're doing this or hey you could do this better talk a little bit about developing some relationships getting to know oh, these guys it's it's so it's a culture shock when when i first got here it's like i didn't i didn't know coming from a small town there's guys from philadelphia trenton you know all over the all over the north or east coast so it's like uh it was weird for me at first but uh, making friends but but these guys embrace me they they treat me like i'm one of their own they love me just as just as one of their own so it's been great Every person on that punt team is so important. I'm um, talking about, you know, kind of managing that, making sure that guys are lined up where they're supposed to, doing all those things. And, and you lean on your coach, Coach Bear. So take us through some of those little things that make special teams an important part because as these yeah. games get a little bit bigger, every detail is so yeah, important. Yeah. Our, our punt team, our long, long snappers, he's, he should be playing FBS football right now. He's one of the best snappers I've ever been with. And uh, our my personal protectors, we got a JMU bounce back, uh, Keyshawn. He always, I never, I haven't got hit yet all year. So um, he's just, one tough dude. Yeah, and and, it, and when I get the ball down there, we're we're on top of it. Uh, they, I don't know how many return yards on on our punt team there have been, but it's not a lot. We've we've been doing really well all year, and uh, that's what we're going to keep continue to do. You ever practice tackling as a punter? <laughs> <laughs> no, I had I had one tackle in high school, one. But I never, never practiced. Uh, well, you got enough guys. You got ten other guys on this Falcon team. But hey, if you get called to duty, you better figure it out, right? <laughs> All right, Luke. Great to hear your story, and we wish you the best here at Lackawanna College. Thank you.